So the day has come and today we're gonna find out who is gonna be the winner of my giveaway and gonna get this beautiful box puzzle designed by Alexander Majoric and made by Pelican. But before I'm gonna announce the winner, I'm gonna entertain you with my hilarious jokes and new puzzle, which is quite exclusive since you can't buy it anywhere. It was released once by Pelican, but now I don't think you can find it anywhere in internet, but I got it and I've 3D printed it. And you may ask where I got it. I got it straight from the puzzle designer. Then probably you can guess who is the puzzle designer. It's a Dr. Volker Latusik, obviously. I can say that we are quite good friends with Volker. And since I've got a 3D printer, he sends me his uh, new projects that are not released yet. They are just projects so that I can 3D print them, test and give him uh, my feedback. But sometimes he sends me uh, puzzles uh, that I can 3D print that were previously released, like a PMR puzzle, which was released by Pelican a couple of years ago. Um, obviously, it was a wooden version of the puzzle, but now I have a 3D printed version. I've printed this puzzle with bronze PLA and painted the half spheres with red, so it's going to be a little bit easier to see what I'm doing. This puzzle has eight half spheres and I have to create four full spheres inside so that I don't see any half sphere outside and the structure is going to be stable. So if I just put them like this and then put on a table and it's going to fall apart, that is not the solution. The solution is supposed to be solved uh, in such a way that the puzzle is going to uh, hold itself pretty well. You may ask why I decided to show you PMR puzzle. The reason is quite simple since Pelican is going to release the bubble puzzle also designed by Dr. Volker Latusek and this puzzle looks very similar but uh, we have four L-shaped parts in a PMR we have a couple of parts that are not L-shaped but kind of V-shaped since they have both sides the same si uh, size uh, and the uh, half spheres are in a completely different spot so the solution of Bubbles puzzle is going to be completely different to the solution of PMR puzzle. So if you're a long time fan of Pelican or Dr. Volker Latusek and already have a PMR puzzle in your collection, you're definitely gonna enjoy Bubbles puzzle as well. Unfortunately, I can't share with you a stale file for this project, but if you just want to see the solution of this puzzle, keep watching this video, but keep in mind that this solution is unique and you're gonna spoil this puzzle for you forever. So let's try to figure out the way how to solve this puzzle. We have just four parts. Each part has this half a sphere on one of the sides and another on the other side. And I have to connect them all something like this so that there will be no visible half a spheres. Okay, that at the first glance may seem easy, but it is not easy at all. I'm gonna stop, start the stopwatch and let's see, that is almost, almost, but then I'm not gonna be able to cover these two half spheres with this piece. I can do one, but then that is not enough. Okay, so let's see what else I can do. Maybe I can do them in pairs like these two here. Yeah, but then one is facing this direction, another is facing this direction. Probably I can do like this, but again, I'm not going to be able to cover these two. Okay, so it seems like it's going to be much more challenging than it looks. Okay, these two pieces are not exactly the same. Since if you take a closer look, you will find that on this side, the cutouts are in exactly the same spot, but here, it is different since on this piece the cutout is here, on this piece it is on this side. So that might be very important. So I tried this before, maybe I'll try this one. These two cutouts are close to each other now. And I can put this one here. Oh, that was so close, so close, but no, I'm not going to be able to cover it and it's not gonna hold itself. Okay, that was very close, but this is not covered and this is not covered and these two are covered in a wrong way. But that looks 
like a nice shape. Have to look for something else. But now, after five minutes, it seems like it is completely impossible. I don't even find a way how to put these parts together. Don't know, don't know what to do. Ah, that's almost. I have only one uh, half a sphere left, but it's not gonna keep this shape. It's gonna fall apart every time I just release the parts. And still this is one is not covered with anything. Again, looks impossible, completely impossible to solve. Oh, and this piece is gonna be... Okay, I think that I found the, the correct shape. I found the way how to... Finally, after 10 minutes, I found the way how to cover all spheres, but I don't know how to put it together in such a way that it's gonna hold itself, since it always falls down. That is not the option. Maybe there is some kind of a random way like this. Oh, that's gonna be difficult to hold it like this. Now it's gonna fall apart. It's gonna fall apart. No. Ah, that means that is not the correct assembly. Maybe I have to look for another one. But that was so close. Okay, maybe I can do it somehow like these. Oh, everything fell apart. I have to find how to put it together again. Maybe something like this. Let's see. This goes here, this goes here. And please... No, no. Feels like everything is falling apart. Yep. The parts are just sliding down and that's it. Oh, that was so close, so close to figuring out the solution. Maybe I can still figure out the way how to put them here. Yeah, but that doesn't look like the correct way to solve it, since usually Dr. Volker Latusek creates something more stable than this one. This takes, oh, almost, yeah, but this slides down. Don't think this is the right way. Okay, I have to keep looking. Probably my attempt wasn't correct this time. Okay, I think that I have to have a break a little bit since now it seems like I've tried all possible combinations and I have to do something else and then try to solve it again. I kept solving this puzzle during the day, each time for a couple of minutes in my car, in a park, uh, in every place where I could grab the parts from my pocket and try to figure out the way how to assemble it. And every time I was figuring out that the assembly was the correct, I found the correct way how to put all parts together. But each time I didn't know how to put it on a desk in such a way that it's gonna hold itself. I'm back and ready to figure out the correct solution. So let's see again, which was the correct one each time I have to start almost from the very beginning since I have to figure out the correct orientation of parts, how I have to put them together in such a way that I'm gonna do exactly the same shape as before. So it was something like this, I think. This goes here, this goes... Uh, no, something is wrong this time. Let's see again, maybe this piece is supposed to be... No, no, not this one, this goes here. This goes... Okay, now I don't even remember how to put parts together in a correct way. This looks nice, but then if I put this piece on top, it doesn't look correct. Let's try again. This goes here. This piece can be here and this piece can be here. So this is it. Yeah, this is it. 
but how to put it in such a way that it's not gonna fall apart it's gonna stay on the desk and not gonna oh i found it finally after many attempts i i found that i was doing wrong okay the, this the shape was correct since i found it the shape was correct but what was wrong my attempt to put these parts together i tried like this i tried like many different possible combinations but i wasn't thinking about this one this is so easy these two parts they go together like this and then i just have to put these two on top and that's it it holds itself pretty well and it looks like a neat solution oh my god that is clever puzzle very clever the pmr puzzle is solved as you could see the solution is unique and you have to think outside the box to figure out the way how to put all parts together and if you're looking forward to solving bubble puzzle i'm pretty sure you will be surprised since the solution is going to be completely different and it's also going to be quite a challenge to find it. And now let's move to figuring out who is going to be the winner of my giveaway. I'm going to use the same site as always to figure out who is going to be the winner. Here I'm going to put a link to the video. Filter duplicate users include replies to comments. Let's see, we have 63 unique comments. Previous time in a previous Pelican release, I think that we had about 66 or 68 uh, unique comments so this time a little bit less and let's find who's going to be the winner and the winner is dave s dave is my long time subscriber i think i saw his first comment maybe a year ago or something like that so congratulations dave uh, write me an email or message in instagram facebook twitter and we will figure out how to send you the puzzle and that's all for today thank you for watching this is not the last giveaway on my channel so Stay subscribed and you will find more puzzles and more giveaways uh, in my next videos. And that's it for today. Like, subscribe, hit the bell button and see you next time.